Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to more Nuclear Throne. Last episode was all about an introduction for me. Figuring out um, how to play this game again after not playing it for like, I don't know, two years or something like that. Today, today we got a little bit different of a goal. Um, today I want to focus on consistency. Um, if I make it to the same place, like five times in a row, I'm going to consider that a massive win. Um, not trying to get as far as possible, just trying to get kind of things steady and straight on the first couple of levels. It's important to create kind of goals for yourself as you go. Um, everybody said Crystal is the easiest character in the game, so I'm actually going to skip Crystal and we're going to play Eyes instead today. Uh, and then I'm just going to hop in and we're going to see what happens. So what is the thing with Eyes today? I don't know. Telekinesis it appears to pull enemies towards me? Is that... It pulls anything towards me. Okay, so it pulls ammo towards me. It, it pulls it pulls literally everything towards me. Okay. Um, I'm gonna be real. It's actually, like, kind of sick. Because I can just, like, you know, pull, pull all of these chests on over to me. And then you get a little assault rifle to get things going. Okay, dude. Okay. You know what? There, there's something good here. There's something good here. People said that Last Wish is the best, um, the best mutation in the game because it, it like, I don't know. They just said it's great. <laughs> so sure, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it. Maybe it was not great. I, I have no idea. Um, maybe it's only great if you're missing some health. And in this case, I just took a completely useless mutation. There's a chance. You also told me that this screwdriver, um, I should use on a, a golden truck at some point. Um, uh, dude, there's a lot to learn. There's a lot to learn. It's, it's a great experience diving into a, a, like, you know, 10 year old game head first, uh, never, never really having any experiences with it. You know, it's something that, uh, it's something that a lot of people have been saying. I, I actually got uh, a little shout out on Twitter from a pretty major uh, game game developer and just uh, you know Twitter and and gaming industry legend um, talking about how it, how it's like to watch somebody play Nuclear Throne um, without really any of that prior knowledge of the game, uh, and I, I appreciate everybody who's enjoying watching me stumble around in this game a little bit. I'm actually having a, a really good time with it. I, I had initially, okay, just like, screw me, I guess. Um, I had initially, when I decided to to put Nuclear Throne on the, the charity goal uh, list, because that's that's why we're playing it, right? Uh, it's it's because I put it as a charity goal for our Aleximus uh, charity this year. And it was, it was a pretty s small goal in the end. Um, I don't remember. It was like twelve fifty or something like that. It's still a lot of money for charity. Let's not let's not get it twisted uh, in any way, shape, or form. But it was something I, I just wanted to do. You know, there's there's certain games that exist um, that it's like as as a content creator in the indie game and roguelite space. Um, there there's certain games that just need to be played <laughs> in order for you to it's not even like to understand indie gaming but it's just to, to like feel good about uh where you stand in the gaming industry An another big one now it's not really a roguelike um but another game that i, I tend to put in that same exact camp that I, I feel like i need to play but i haven't ever played i've, I've never played dark souls right so it's like is dark souls one of those uh one of those games that I should be spending more time with. I'm going to take Rabbit Paw. Maybe it's bad. I don't know. Um, and then I'm going to take Strong Spirit. I still don't know. I think Strong Spirit seems better than Last Wish, but everybody said Last Wish is good, so I don't know, man. I'm, I'm just... I'm just here so I don't get fined. Um, what the heck? This is like a, a super version? Oh, this is going to be bad. This is gonna be bad. Okay. Oh, you know what? It's actually completely fine. 
I'm, I'm just gonna like run away from him. Okay, you got me. Fair enough. You got me. I'm gonna try to suck all this up. And then like we do have to go fight the large dog. Oh, never mind. He's dead as hell. <laughs> just, just the way I, I like big dog. Dead as hell. Unless it's like a husky. And then I'm more than happy to to give him a belly rub and call him a good boy. Right? All right. Is that a screwdriver? It is. Um, I am going to take the screwdriver because, again, today is about uh, consistency, also known as um, finding secrets that we probably shouldn't worry about. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. Get destroyed? I will say that I'm, I'm thinking that it was probably a horrible idea to take a grenade launcher as my primary uh, choice of weapon here, but I'm also, like, just going to tell you, this is kind of slapping um, and doing a lot of damage, so I think it's fun. I just blew myself up. Okay. Uh, you know how I said consistency was the key today? I kind of meant, like, consistently making it further than 1-1, one, one. Um, <laughs> but alas, here we are, right? Here we are. Pretty, pretty bad, pretty bad thus far. Let, let's, uh... Let's improve. Let's improve. This, this this is the the run now. This is the run. If you if you always believe you're gonna die, you never succeed, right? You know, if you go into a battle royale going, man, I really hope I get second this time. You're never gonna get first. Some kills regenerate HP. Long arms is interesting to me. Um, I'm going to take some kills regenerate HP. That it seems. You know, I'm still kind of in the camp of trying to comprehend what mutations are good, what mutations are bad. A lot of people said, Tyler, uh, in terms of weapons, you know, for one, I had a lot of people go, um, Tyler, melee weapons are trash. And then I had the same uh, 100 people reply again with um, how much melee weapons are not trash. Um, so I, frankly, I got no freaking clue whether melee weapons are good or not. The main thing that I kind of came to after listening to everybody was that all of the weapons are like fine so just play with whatever you enjoy um and then you'll end up having like success at some point in time and i you know what i i like i like a game that allows me to play with the weapons i like and and just let me kind of vibe and, and choose what i want in saying this, I'm actually going to just straight up say that I actually hate games that do that. Um, I, I like games that force me to use certain things a lot more. I do like the laser pistol, though. The laser pistol is kind of slappy, though. It's kind of slappy. I'm going to take the AR laser pistol. The laser pistol, dude, it's... it's. <laughs> I also almost said laser piss like eight times there. Uh, but it's, it's good stuff. It's good stuff. Let's take the rabbit pot people also said I'm, I'm trying to remember i think it's the red chest i don't pick up and then if i don't pick it up that gives me a chance for like a super chest later there's like a 25 percent chance like a planetarium in isaac um so that, that's something that we're gonna try out as well maybe not on this run since i i feel like i'm i'm already committing to a certain play style on this one get destroyed you get destroyed too okay i'm getting some some energy uh ammo I'm, I'm maxed up on energy ammo so don't pick up the red chest and then there's a chance that that red chest turns into something you know super slappy in the future that that's what i'm i'm banking on right now honestly this floor went great i i got no complaints that went insanely well um, max HP, more HP from medkits, extra chest spawn. You, you take strong spirit. I, I believe people said take strong spirit at all at all costs. So I, I have taken it. Not exactly at all costs, but at several costs, right? We, we lose out on rhino skin, which I still think is probably like halfway decent for someone like me who doesn't really know what they're doing because extra HP, like how can you, how can you be mad about extra potential? That's going to hurt extra potential uh to be able to get hit okay i am low on energy that that seems like a damn shame after you just told me i had maxed uh, energy ammo a little bit ago so that that seems like some trash okay you opened my chest 
which I'm not exactly happy about because I was supposed to not do that. It's a laser rifle. Okay, yo, wait a minute, though. Is the laser rifle just a better version of the laser pistol? Because it, it, it kind of appears to be the same level of smacky, but maybe even smackier. Is, is that what we're looking at here? Oh, you, you tried to sneak in, buddy. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow, slow your roll, my dude. Slow your freaking roll. Okay, we there's there's snipers on, on lanes that I can't even comprehend right now. Uh, the popo, we're going to come momentarily. That's important to remember as well. Um, they're, they're, they're always happy to get right into your freaking business. I refuse to make any other jokes here. <laughs> Everything I say can or will be used against me in the court of law. Um, do I, so do I have to anger the popo? The answer to that is, it appears to be yes. So I will anger the popo. Uh, here they come. I'm, I'm not, I'm not afraid of them. I'm really not. Is are you, there more of you? No, there's a freaking vulture down here. Get, get out of here, buddy. Okay. So, does that open... Th this is nothing. Okay, I don't freaking know, man. I don't freaking know. Just leave the chest behind. I'm, I'm gonna tell you, I still think that I probably should be doing something with that chest, but that's okay. Um, stronger telekinesis. I don't think we care. Some kills generate ammo. Seems... Okay. That seems okay. I do, dude. I, the laser pistol, and by pistol I mean just laser anything. Okay. I mean, I did just straight up miss these guys like 15 times, but it still seems good to me. And then I proceeded to not pick up any of the ammo, so I, I lose out on a good chunk of benefit. Do not even try, buddy. Whoa, that's a big chest, dude. That's a big chest. I, I have uh, I have seen I have seen what needs to be done. This sniper can frick off, but honestly, big 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 uh, big dog too. <laughs> Electric boogaloo. <laughs> okay, yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. You got me. You got me. I I should try a different character in each of these episodes and, and do like multiple multiple characters an episode. But I'm gonna tell you, there's there's something oddly satisfying about uh about just running the same damn guy over and over and, and seeing what comes of us you did open my red chest which i'm mad about but you did give me a crossbow which is like actually my favorite weapon in the game everybody told me in my obsession with the crossbow they were like uh crossbow kind of slappy so continue to use it and and i am i am more than pleased to continue using the slappy bow not to be confused with Flappy Bird, extremely different game. Uh, what do you do here, man? I actually just telekinesis those things away. I will not open that red chest. I will not take your grenade launcher. Just kidding, I will. Um, and then I'll kill you. Oops. Is that everybody? What the heck? There's still people down here. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> okay, yeah, I enjoyed that a lot. I enjoyed that a lot. Um, more HP ammo drops. Higher rate of fire? No, 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 no. Let's... I, I'll take the rabbit paw. And and the rabbit's paw curls. That's not really how it normally goes, but... It, it was a good joke. I blew myself up again. Okay. The consistency that we have come to today... Is unfortunately that I consistently kill myself. Um, more often than I should. So maybe that's a testament to the fact that explosive weapons may not be my jam. Um, or I just need to, like, pay just a, a half an ounce of attention um, while playing this game. That seems like the more logical thing to do. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. So, we did not pick up the chest. Um, I'm seeing what we can do, right? It, it is a, a higher quality chest. Okay. Um, I will open this, and it's going to be something I've never seen before. It's, it's a laser pistol. And a machine gun. And also the slugger. The only slugger that I know is uh, the greatest Wii game of all time, Mario Super Slugger. And I have a feeling that Birdo will not be hitting a Grand Slam in Nuclear Throne right now. Um, but I'd be happy to be proven wrong on that one. That said, I'm, I'm going to not take 
the slugger, dude, the telekinesis, he's actually like freaking cracked. I kind of like uh, eyes here, man. Eyes is, he's okay. He's okay. Kills lower your reload time, slower enemy bolts. You know what? Slow down the enemy bolts. Maybe, maybe I need to play on easy mode. And perhaps this is, this is how you play on easy mode. This plus the telekinesis. I'm not saying that it's, it's game winning, but maybe it, it's pretty good. Okay, just, just like... He's still alive? Are you freaking kidding me? Okay. That was too easy. That was too easy. Machine Gun Proper. Not to be confused with Machine Gun Kelly. Um, completely different person as well. Dude, am I about to leave another red chest behind and see if we can get another big one? Um, am I about to defile this nuclear throne grave for money? Of course I am. Let's do it. Uh, it's a wrench. I don't care. The screwdriver is what we're interested in. I, I think... Maybe. I don't know. Um, kills regenerate HP. Or do you just go for more max HP? I'm gonna... I still think that if I'm trying to get far, I'm gonna play differently. I'm not trying to get far. I'm trying to, to form some consistency. Get used to certain enemies. Understand these areas a little bit more. We do all of that. We're gonna have success in the future. Again, today's not about making it as far as possible. I'm not gonna like, you know... Oops, we reached a new area, you know, dive into a grenade kind of thing. But I am going to take upgrades that I think are, are more meant to teach me the game than get me further. Maybe it's a stupid play. I don't know. I, I wouldn't be the first one to do stupid plays. Uh, what is this Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, vent right here? Are you seeing this? Is that always there? <laughs> Because I don't think it is. What the heck is the splinter gun? Uh, yeah. Okay, we're going to keep that. What the hell is all this, man? Another assault rifle? Sure. I probably do not need to do it. It's like a triple crossbow is what this son of a gun is. Tell, tell me, look me in the eye and tell me that this is not the greatest thing ever. I'm just going to real quickly check and see. Okay, that, apparently that is not a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles vent that I can go down. Um, that's fine. I don't, I don't need to go down it anyway. Kills regenerate ammo, less enemy HP. Homing bolts. I think people said this is like a horrible item. Or a horrible thing. Now you take strong spirit. Okay. We're vibing. We do not have a screwdriver, by the way. No, no orange juice and vodka for me. Um, maybe, maybe later. It is like the middle of the workday for me, so it probably would not be advisable to get trashed on like a drink from the 1940s. Okay, it, little sniper man, you you can die. You also explode, so that's something that we need to keep in mind as well. I got no bolts in my gun, so I guess we're gonna be rocking rocking a little uh, assault rifle action. Just blow it all up. Get it out of here. The pop rifle. I do not know what you do. So this is going to be an interesting... What, what is your problem? What the heck, dude? It's so... It's so big. <laughs> and do not say a word. It was huge. I kind of still want the, the splinter bow. Okay, never mind. I guess I'll leave. You want to send me down? I'll, I'll go down. Okay, I actually think this gun is trash. The damage on it is not good. And I feel like, dude, I do see the number of snipers in the room. Holy crap. I'm trying to collect all this crap, man. There's too much crap around. Okay, grenade launcher. Oh, I haven't killed myself with one of these in uh, checks the workplace incident board uh, one run. So let's do it. Wii U, Wii U. This is the sound of the police. Do not get out of here. What the heck happened right there? Okay, you gotta go, my friend. Time for you to go. Uh, we actually survived this. That's a that's a miracle. This is a uh, big big dog, twin dog. What's his name? Is it big dog? Who's the first guy? If because this guy definitely looks like a dog, so I I would imagine that this guy is actually big dog. The assault slugger. Okay, sure. If yeah, if I have to. Are you big dog? 
You are big dog. Who the hell is the first guy then? Is it little dog? Because that would be some unfortunate naming if you called the first guy little dog and then the second guy big dog. It just seems unnecessary. Okay, he's he's dead as hell. That's a laser pistol. Do we care about the laser pistol? Okay, uh, <laughs> the answer to that is gonna be no. It's gonna be no. Um, people said sharp teeth is good, I think. So I'm, I'm gonna take sharp teeth. Congratulations, we've made it back to uh, the Cave of Wonders. Somewhere where we, uh, we did make it in the last episode, but just, just for a little. Okay, I'm scared. Dude, I got like no bullets. Okay, great, great shot, loser. Just, just like stay far away from your explosives and then take a seeker shotgun. Do I know what the heck the seeker shotgun does? Okay, yeah, it's pretty sick is what it does. Except like the damage when you don't actually hit the enemies is pretty bad. I guess we're going down. Okay, this is the farthest we've made it. That's important to know. Um, killing lowers your reload time. Sure, that seems that seems okay. Uh, what we we have made it here. This is where we died last time. Instead, actually, do I know what's going on here? I only have grenades. Um, I'm gonna tell you. I think we've made some unfortunate decision making on this one. Uh, dude, those guys all blow up. Okay, I'm gonna try to get some of these uh, ammo and things at me. Okay, there's more ammo, dude. I need I need all of it. Um, they're they like they like to move it. They like to move it. Okay, I'm low on HP. Just just send them in. Send them in. I need the med kit. What's the triple machine gun and why do I need it right now? Get rid of the grenade launcher. Yeah, you know what? The the triple machine gun will do just fine. Thanks. It'll do just fine. Give me give me these. Oh my. The triple machine gun kind of smacky. It's kind of smacky. I'm I'm enjoying it. We we have survived another level. He's he's actually ascending to a brand new uh, tier of gameplay. There is a, a nuclear snowman up there. What the heck, dude? I should have been playing this for, uh, Oleximus. Holiday-themed content the entire damn way. I am low on bullets. Okay, so this thing freaking shreds through bullets. That's, that's one thing I've now learned. Oh crap, dude. The Popo are back. That is gonna be unfortunate, I think. I don't have the ammo for this. I don't have the anything for this. Never mind. What? <laughs> Did you hear that scream? That was incredible. This dude lifted up a car. Okay, I'm I'm starting to be like, what the heck is going on in here, man? There's there's some interesting things going on. Um. Okay. Yeah. That seems. That seems like I probably should have died there. Send send everything in. Not enough bolts. Not enough bolts. Not enough bolts. I'm just spamming. I'm just spamming. Did he survive again? The seeker pistol. Uh, no. I don't think so. There's still people down here, man. Get, get out of here. Die. Oh, what the heck? There's still a whole nother part of the level. Okay, this level is fricked, man. There's too much going on. Uh, what is that? Dude, what is that? I, I just destroyed something. I don't know what it was. Why are my guns, like, total butt cheek as well? Okay, see you later. I got 20 bullets in this thing. Seems bad. Um, rabbit paw. Yeah. That seems good. There's gonna be a boss here. Um, I don't know what to do. This is, this is, is too much to think about. Uh, little hunter? Who the heck is little hunter? Uh, I, dude, I'm I'm actually, I I just ran into the heat of battle. Okay, I see a med kit. Uh, the popo are here too. It's a blood hammer. What the heck is a blood hammer? Um, this dude teleports. I'm. Uh, there's too many sounds. 
Like, you think I'm supposed to know what the heck is going on in here? I'm, I'm just kind of running around hoping for the best. Ah, uh, dude, I actually think we're cracked, though. <laughs> I think we're cracked. Heavy revolver. I'm going to go with probably not for me. I still, I, I kind of think that this, uh, you know what, dude? Give, give me, give me the heavy revolver. Yeah, honestly, that seems, that seems like it's going to smack extremely hard. There's going to be an enemy, like, over here. Yeah. They got chests over here, too, man. Okay. Send, send me down. I'm, I'm, I'm in the heat of it, man. What the heck is all of this? What the heck is all of this, man? Why are they all coming for me? I just, just spam, just spam. Everything must go. There's too many small enemies. There's too many small enemies. We got shells out the ass right now. Uh, the level's done. Okay, see ya. <laughs> Where am I? The popo are here. The uh. Uzi Slime from uh, Nightmare Before Christmas is here. Ooga Booga, whatever his name is. I got no ammo in any of my guns, man. Uh, what? <laughs> okay. Um. Well, honestly, that was an experience. That was definitely an experience. Um, dude, seven one though. Seven one's pretty good. That's pretty good. And we unlocked a, a new character. We unlocked steroids. He is inaccurate, but he has automatic weapons. Okay. And then there's the melting. People said the melting's the hardest. Okay. You know what? I'm I'm happy. Um, I am going to call it here. Next episode, we're going to hop in as Crystal with the goal of I've seen future floors. I need to make it back there. I need to see what's, what's crack-a-lacking on the future floors. Join me next time. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.